Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Amber if you're new here and I'm a graduate student studying nutrition at the University of Florida on my way to become a dietitian. So I love food, I love nutrition, and I love sharing my grocery hauls with you guys. This week is from Aldi, so if you're interested in what I buy on a weekly basis, just keep watching. So this week I got a lot of fun things I haven't tried before and my total was $48, which is right on budget. If you saw last week's video from Trader Joe's, I went highly over budget. So this week I really wanted to stay below 50. But to start off, um, I'm excited for these. I got their like five pound bag of grapefruits. I love these, like cold in the, like refrigerate them overnight and then have them for like a little snack with my breakfast. And they're really good price from Aldi. Then I got some coleslaw. I don't usually eat coleslaw and I think I'll more so put this on my salads than just eat it plain, but it's really nice because it's cabbage and carrots. So you just toss that in your salad and add some more fiber. As well as I always get my grapes from Aldi. They're the best price that I've found so far. I just got like a smallish bag of some green grapes. I love to snack on these, especially with like some cheese and almonds. Picked up some baby spinach. I always have spinach on hand as well as bananas. These are pretty much in all of my videos, but the newest thing I'm doing with bananas is making banana pancakes in the morning. I'm going to be working on a recipe and hopefully putting that up on my Instagram, which you guys should follow me on. And then today is actually the Sunday of the Super Bowl. So I wanted to do a few like Super Bowl-y foods and I think I'm going to make some loaded potato skins. So I got a bag of the russet potatoes and then some of the other things I got, um, chives to top those off with. And I'm gonna try to make them in the air fryer. I got the bag of long carrots that I usually do. I think it's a lot more economical to peel them and chop them up yourself rather than buying the pre-cut ones. Also for tonight is a cauliflower. I wanna do the um, buffalo cauliflower. So I picked up this hot sauce to make. I've never actually made the buffalo cauliflower, but I feel like it's all the rage. So I'm just gonna look up a recipe online for that. And then I think the last Super bowl -y food that I'm going to do is zucchini fries. You kind of like do like egg wash and then breadcrumbs and then you put them in the air fryer as well, maybe topped with some cheese. And this is the cheese that I got to go on top of the potato skins, uh, the reduced fat sharp cheddar. Moving into some other items, I picked up their firm organic tofu. I think I've only had this once. I usually get the tofu from Trader Joe's, but I mean, I'm sure it's good. And then a pack of eggs. And then a few sauces I got. I just got a marinara pasta sauce and this pasta, I've never tried this. It's the Casarici, Casar <laughs> that's probably such a bad pronunciation, but um bronze cut pasta looks good just simple dinner throw some frozen veggies in there as well as this tikka masala sauce um and i also bought this brown basmati rice which i didn't really know was a thing i thought there was pretty much only white basmati to go with this tiki masala sauce one night this week and you know a protein in the veggie thought that sounded good and different and also very easy since it's already in the can or bottle what is this a jar that's what it is <laughs> and these two little sweeter items i thought these looked super good they're called cookie thins um never tried them before a little snack if i'm craving something sweet and then dark chocolate. I love dark chocolate. I went for the sea salt caramel one this time. And then lastly, some frozen items. I got the bag of frozen blueberries. I use blueberries almost 
daily, especially if I'm making oatmeal. They're my favorite thing to throw into the oats. So I got those as well as just some frozen asparagus spears. As I said, you can incorporate these into a lot of the different meals like the tikka masala or with the pasta. And I think that is everything. That was a pretty good haul. I'm excited to make the Super Bowl themed um, food today as well as just picking up some staples. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul and I'll see you guys soon.